We begin with that breaking headline today, a Michigan doctor sentenced being called a monster. A day of reckoning for the doctor who diagnosed hundreds of patients with cancer when they did not have it. Outside the court, the tears and anger. He lied to so many patients, giving many of them extensive chemotherapy, which then made them sick. So many of those families today coming face to face with the doctor as he was sentenced to 45 years behind bars. And you're about to hear what the doctor said to those families. ABC's Ron Claiborne leads us off. Judgment day for the doctor who caused so much pain. Victims of Dr. Farid Fatah outside the courtroom where he was sentenced, hand in hand, then defiant. 45 years for the lives that he took. It just wasn't enough. In court, the 50-year-old doctor breaking down, saying, I misused my talents, yes, and permitted this sin to enter me because of power and greed. But those words, no comfort for Cheryl Blades. I could hear him talking to my mother because I went to every appointment. So I could hear him talking to her and promising her to save her. In all, Fata pleaded guilty to intentionally misdiagnosing more than 550 patients, often prescribing treatment for cancer that they did not have. He earned more than $17 million as a result. Dr. Fata pounced on every opportunity to use a patient's body as a profit center. One of the patients, 53-year-old Monica Flagg. Stressful. It was extremely emotional. In 2000.